Welcome to this two-minute guide on detecting multicast activity. My name is Dara Delaney. I'm Head of Technical Services here at Netforge Technologies. So you're now looking at the Langardian web front end. It took me about 15 minutes to get the system up and running on my network, and I'm capturing data from my core switch. So to check for multicast, I go to Bandwidth, IP, Track Distribution. In the subnet filter here, I put in 224.0.0.0/4, which is the multicast IP range, and I run the report. So I now get to find out the levels of multicast on my network. So just before I do some analysis on this, I'm going to go to More Actions, Save Report, and I'm going to call it Multicast. Give it a description, and save that. That just means now when I go to the Report Finder and type in Multicast, here's my report listed. I can just click on it and I can run it. So we do see some s small levels of multicast on this network. So we've got some universal plug and play protocol. So we can start to drill down and figure out well, where is it originating from. Drill down again to find out what systems. And what, on the next screen here, we will get a list of systems which are generating multicast traffic. So that's it. That's how you can quickly check for multicast activity on your network.